Introducing GEPDW 7300 Dishwasher. Proper installation. Connect to a grounded metal, permanent wiring system. Or run an equipment grounding conductor with the circuit conductors and connect to the equipment grounding to middle or lead of the appliance. Use supply conductors rated at least 75 degrees Celsius. About the dishwasher control panel. Control settings. Status indicator light. The lights will come on indicating the sequence of operation the dishwasher is in. Sensing displayed while the Xtraclean sensor is measuring the amount of soil and temperature of water. The dishwasher will adjust the selected cycle to achieve optimal performance. Washing display during pre-wash and main wash periods. Rinsing display during rinse periods. Drying display during heated dry. Sanitize displayed when cycle has met sanitization conditions. Light remains on until door is opened. Clean displayed when a wash cycle is complete. The light will remain on until door is opened. Time remaining display. During operation, the display shows the minutes remaining until the cycle is complete. Selections. The light above the selected pad will be on to indicate which wash cycle has been selected. Antibacteria heavy 10.0 gallons of liter, 93 minutes. Medium 8.6 gallons of liter, 90 minutes. Light 7.2 gallons of liter, 90 minutes. This cycle raises the water temperature in the final rinse to sanitize your dishware. Cook heavy 11.4 gallons of liter, 95 minutes. Wear medium 10.0 gallons of liter, 71 minutes. Light 10.0 gallons of liter, 6 to 6 minutes. This cycle is meant for heavily soiled dishes or cookware with dried on or baked on soils. Normal wash heavy 9.9 .9 gallons of liter, 74 minutes. Medium 7.0 gallons of liter, 61 minutes. Light 5.6 gallons of liter, 48 minutes. This cycle is for medium slash heavily soiled dishes and glassware. Speed cycle heavy 9.3 gallons of liter, 36 minutes. Medium 7.2 gallons of liter, 36 minutes. Light 5.7 gallons of liter, 33 minutes. This cycle is for everyday dishes and glassware. China Crystal Heavy 10.0 gallons of liter, 49 minutes. Medium 7.2 gallons of liter, 36 minutes. Light 7.2 gallons of liter, 36 minutes. This cycle is for lightly soiled china and crystal. Glasses Heavy 10.0 gallons of liter, 45 minutes. On some models. Medium 7.2 gallons of liter, 33 minutes. Light 7.2 gallons of liter, 32 minutes. This cycle is specifically designed for glasses. Rinse only heavy 2.9 gallons of liter, 7 minutes. Light 1.4 gallons of liter, 3 minutes. For rinsing partial loads that will be washed later. Do not use detergent with this cycle. Enhancements. The light above the selected pad will be on to indicate which enhancement has been selected. Pre for use. With heavily soiled and slush or dried on, baked on soils. Heated dry light off. Shuts off the drying heat option. Dishes air dry naturally and energy is saved. Heated dry light on. Turns the heater on for fast drying. This will extend the time to your wash cycle by 8 minutes for the speed cycle and 30 minutes for all other cycles. Lock. You can lock the controls to prevent any selections from being made. Added heat. When selected, the cycle will run longer with heating elements on to improve both wash and dry performance. Delay hours. You can delay the start of a wash cycle for up to 9 hours. Press the delay hours pad to choose the number of hours you want to delay the start of the cycle. Reset. To change a cycle after washing stops, touch the start slash reset pad to cancel the cycle. The start slash reset light will flash while the water is pumped out if needed. Start. Close the dishwasher door and select the cycle and desired enhancements. Touch the start slash reset pad to begin the cycle. Clean. The clean light is illuminated when a wash cycle is complete. The light will stay on until the door is opened. Using the dishwasher. Check the water temperature. The entering water should be at least 120 degrees Fahrenheit and not more than 150 degrees Fahrenheit for effective cleaning and to prevent dish damage. Use Jet Dry Registered Rinse Agent. Jet Dry Registered Rinse Agent removes spots and prevents new film buildup on your dishes, glasses, flatware, cookware and plastic. Filling the dispenser, the rinse agent dispenser holds 3.5 ounces of rinse agent. Make sure the dishwasher door is fully open. Turn the dispenser knob to the left and lift it out. Add rinse agent until the indicator window looks full. 
Clean up any spilled rinse agent with a damp cloth. Replace the dispenser knob. Dish preparation prior to loading. No pre-rinsing of normal food soil is required. Scrape off hard soils, including bones, toothpicks, skins, and seeds. Remove large quantities of any remaining food. Remove leafy vegetables, meat trimmings, and excessive amounts of grease or oil. Remove acidic food soils that can discolor stainless steel. Using the dishwasher door. The door must be closed to select a load selection or an enhancement. Proper use of detergent. All wash cycles except rinse only require detergent in the main and pre-wash cup. The amount of detergent to use depends on whether your water is hard or soft. Loading the dishwasher racks. Upper rack Although the upper rack is for glasses, cups and saucers, pots and pans can be placed in this rack for effective cleaning. Lower rack The lower rack is best used for plates, saucers and cookware. Large items such as broiler pans and baking grats should go along the left-hand side. Silverware basket. A variety of options is available regarding the three-piece silverware basket in your dishwasher. The complete basket is designed to fit on the right side of the lower rack. Caring for the dishwasher. Cut off electrical power to the dishwasher. Turn off the water supply and disconnect the water inlet line from the water valve. Drain water from the water inlet line and water valve. Reconnect the water inlet line to the water valve. For more updates, subscribe to our channel.